My name is Christopher Andre, and I grew up on Star Trek and Stargate. And I will present to you today my script for Explorers. In 2015, humans have been forced to go underground due to World War III missiles destroying the ozone layer, making the surface uninhibitable. By 2135, resources are running scarce. An elite team is sent to the surface to find medicine. What they find on there is far more horrible than anything they could have ever imagined. Everybody likes an adventure, especially males and females ages 18 to 35. Now, on many of our destinations here, we have, we're going to have the underground. And the underground is our caves, and we have these cave walls, cave cities, which is electricity city, food city, water city, where each of our supplies come from. Not only that, we've got our various surfaces. We've got our snowy wasteland, which is like the wasteland of Washington, D.C., what's left of it. We've got the New York City sewers, which is kind of this prison-type area and that we don't really know completely what went on during the war, but we're going to find out during the series. And we've also got kind of the tropical zones. We've got a tropic area. And this show has many cityscapes, landscapes, so the perfect area to shoot it would be a place like Vancouver, Montreal, Toronto, anywhere that has a lot of cityscapes. Now our team our main character who's going to be joining our team in the pilot, his name is Connors Parker. He's a thief. He is uh, 21 years old. He's kind of smart. He's kind of cocky. Shia LaBeouf if he did television. We are also going to be joined by Jenny O'Reilly. She's 21 years old, blonde hair, blue eyes, very, very sexy. If you took Sarah Paxton and Megan Fox and made them into one person. Our next character is Rytus O'Reilly, Jenny's older brother. Now, if you took the Beast on X-Men and you made him into a modern character, the guy is strong and he's also very intelligent. And then our final character is Gloria Johnson. She is a 22-year-old, blind, kind of prophet-type character, but she also has the attitude that, you know what, if you fall down, you dust yourself off, and that's because she went blind early in life and she's learned to deal with it. And finally, our last character, who kind of created this team, his name is Jack Porter. He's a Jack Nicholson, 64, I won't take any of your crap. If I have to repeat myself, you're in big trouble. You know what, you're complaining, you might as well be put to death type character. The mystery surrounding Jack is, this is the fourth explorer's group to kind of go and start to explore the surface. So we really, Jack's intentions are very, very questionable. And we're left to wonder if he really does know that the surface may be inhibitable and may be livable and why he's wanting people to live underground. Great. Thank you. Well, this was really helpful to further the marketing of the script because I think that's just equally as important as writing. 50% is the writing. I think the other 50% is really getting yourself out there and saying who you are. And I would say through this program, I've learned a lot of how to really market myself. It's just been a wonderful trip and it's been one of the nicest places I've been to in a long time. So. Yeah, I want to thank you all. And then with Bruno and Lauren, we talked a little bit about the pitch and also Film Freeway and, and filmfestivals.com and your, your blog and how that can kind of help market myself into the marketplace. And we'll be working with you guys on um, really positioning myself into a good position, hopefully eventually meeting with networks, with agents, and you know, really, really learning on where I need to be in order to be in the right place at the right time. And everything like that and getting completely